things are starting to shift in the midst of the COVID-19 pandemic. We're not totally back to normal, but it seems like things are heading in that direction. One of the things that I've noticed is that while we're glad to go to restaurants again or sporting events or even to church again, we do so with very different feelings and attitudes. There are some people who are grateful to be back or for the opportunity to resume some things that we couldn't do during the height of the pandemic. And then there are some people who can be angry, mean, and short. Tensions are high in many places. A lot of businesses are having a hard time finding workers. Those things are causing a lot of anger and rudeness. And that has been going on throughout what we've experienced in the last 14 months. But it's been going on for a lot longer than that, too. There are always sides to things, always two different opinions or views, but imagine if we focused on the thing that unites us instead of divides us. Yes, we can still disagree, we can even be angry sometimes, but we're also dealing with our fellow humans created in God's image too. There's always going to be a decision someone doesn't like, and trust me, in this COVID-19 time, it feels like all of the decisions we are making are lose-lose, but especially in the church, we've tried to consider all people and take what we think is best, is in the best interest of our community to heart. Listen to this quote from Fred Rogers, or Mr. Rogers as many of us know him by. Imagine if we all walked into the world with the belief that each person was inherently worthy. Imagine if our goal was to help each other recognize that we are worthy of being loved. Imagine if we sought to listen more than we spoke. Imagine this week. Be kind to yourself and others. Have patience. Get the COVID-19 vaccine. Even wear a mask. Because taking care of others is what Jesus' people do. This is your moment of peace with Peace Lutheran Church.